ashamed to have left that behind. Ragnarok armor's on the house. We'll call it a commemorative piece. You'll be cutting them down like wheat. A nice knife. Shame it's rusted. Well, that's all the lost artifacts from Tyr's temple. Fancy a visit to a certain dwarven shopkeeper?
finish the story. Gladly. It was said that Yari and Soma first shared a kiss in the fields of Jotunheim. Oh? How'd they manage to reach Jotunheim? Don't know. Point is, they went on countless expeditions, each location more beautiful than the last. But they found as they did, the destination became less important than simply traveling together. And the unnameable thing? It was home. Yari and Somar had found it in each other. You are. 
our Atreus is threatened. Ah, oh, <laughs> hi, hey, you're Loki's dad, right? Saw you at the whole Ragnarok thing. I'm Skjolder. The lad who's been organizing the displaced Midgardians. What are you doing? Oh, uh, Loki told me this story about Odin inviting him to Asgard and giving him an Aesir coin that you threw away, and, well, I thought I'd come here and see if I could find it. And I did, if you can believe it. But, uh, it's kind of stuck, because you're, like, crazy strong, apparently. I I'm sorry, did, did you want to keep it? No. It is yours. You sure? It's probably really valuable. I mean, that's not why I'm after it, but... If I were gonna sell a genuine Asgardian artifact touched by at least three gods, I'd expect that fetch, uh, well, a whole lot. Probably enough to buy my own boat, set out, and make my fortune. The coin is yours. Good luck to you. Thanks. You too. And, uh, if you see Throod, uh, uh, never mind. You wished word of Thor's daughter. Throod? You saw Throod? How is she? She is well. She has recovered her father's hammer. Oh, that's amazing. Don't you worry. She's gonna do good with that thing. She's an amazing person. Probably my favorite. I mean, not like that. She doesn't have time for boys, but I, you know, I don't, I don't care. She's just, she's just great. Is it getting warmer? I, I feel like it's getting warmer. <laughs> How about that thaw? You sure we shouldn't help him out? He needs to feel he earned it. Let him do so.
We're heading back to Charlie? Yes. He's not gonna be very happy with me. No. Charlie. I'm sorry, I was... I have no excuse for neglecting you. I will do my best to earn it. For your garden. Merkweed. I know, but I can't stay. There's still things I must do. Kratos, I should look for someone who can watch over him. Permanently. Goodbye, Charlie. Mm -hmm. Which challenge should we undertake?
is it heading to the center platform? Let's go find out. We could always warm up first. Here we go again! Enemy behind you, Kratos! Fire behind you! No!
Make some magic.
anymore. Y'all know where to find me. Woo! You're the broad a pail of water for 20. We could always warm up first. Got the atom! I'll fight the next out! No. is yours. You're on fire, Kratos! I won't 
It avoids every attack! What for?
have brought a pail of water. Or 20. Woohoo! That'd be good. A good fit.
the unique rewards all Sutter had to offer. The steel needs to be.
stuff for you. Let's make some magic. Window shopper. What can I do you for?
No matter what you try, the results are <gasps> good. I'll see you pay for what you've done. Careful, brother. You're covered in my thought.
judge me. You, whose cowardice has left entire realms in ruin. Sister, I know the hate that burns you from within. I have felt those flames, known the comfort of their warmth. I wronged you. And I cannot change that. Never apologize enough for it. But the hatred, vengeance, you have to let it go. Finish it. <sighs> yes, sister. There. I'm sorry it came to that. I gave her what she wanted. Thank you. So then, how's it feel being king of the Valkyries once more? There are no Valkyries left. The Shield Maidens. Will you not lead them? Or rebuild? Maybe. It would be the first time in a while I have something truly mine. We'll see. Woo! You're in a broad a pail of water! Money! I knew we'd left something behind. to be very impressed.
Now, I know it's hard being here without them, but I'm sure old Brock would be glad you're here. And I'm sure Sindri, wherever he I'll is... I'll be in the study. ...would appreciate you tidying up after yourself. Now, go ahead. survived bloody Ragnarok. I should think he's as prepared as anyone could be. To survive, yes. But to love. Brother? Angraboda. Does he... Oh. Well, there were certain topics on which I suppose I may have been a touch more approachable. I did my level best to teach him the ropes. Then you taught the boy to woo. To be perfectly honest, brother, I taught him how I wish I'd wooed. I wonder if Sindri will ever come back. Can this place ever feel like a home after what happened here? I never thought I'd miss their bickering. But it's really not the same place without those two, is it? We will maintain it until his return. is the man who tamed Garm. A thousand congratulations. All that said, I'm happy to discuss anything else on your mind. Ratatoskar, I'm curious. You said the tree had plans for you. What exactly has it got you doing? What do I not do, my decapitated delight? I overlook and maintain the stability of the realms, ensure that everything is running smoothly. And, of course, I tend to the world tree. I listen to it, Make sure its needs are met. Do you talk to the tree? The tree does not speak in any tongue, but its intentions are clearly felt. Yes, I do realize how, for lack of a better word, kooky that sounds, but it is true. Is it saying anything right now? It's saying stop asking stupid questions. Bitterness manners. But yes, it is saying something along those lines. Well. I'll leave you to it. Oh, sorry, that's it. Yeah, that's... we're done. <laughs> Go away now. <laughs> 